Brenna again, helping you to set up your online learning portfolio. Start by tapping the Add New Page icon, which is here. The name of your page will depend on what your teacher tells you. Some examples include adding pages for each contact area or a page to document the books you're reading and maybe even a page to showcase your passion projects. My first page is going to be called My Learner Profile. There are five templates to choose from. I'm going to leave this as web page. Tap Create and you should see My Learner Profile on the left. Let's add two more pages, just to make sure you understand. Tap Add New Page icon, and this page will be named My Reading Log. The template I'll use on this one is a list, so I can list all of my books. Tap Create, and notice that it shows up on the left. I'm going to use the template under Create Your Own by tapping Use Template. For the first column, I will type my book name. Then, I will add a column. This column will be named Author. Add a column and name it the Genre. Add another column, and this one will be the Summary. Your teacher may want you to add additional columns or name them differently. But when you're done, tap Save. Scroll back to the top and let's add one more page. This one will be named Passion Projects, and we'll use the File Cabinet as the template. That's it for video two for creating pages for your learning portfolio. Future videos will get more specific on adding content to your portfolio pages.